Hello and welcome to episode 20 of TGIF. And Panther has decided to join me today. He's the one peeking out the window. And he's also the first slide. So we have Panther showing Mr. Mercedes, which is the book that I was finishing a few weeks back. And, of course, that look on his face is, Mom, you need to finish one book, and you've just been to the thrift store buying more. Yes, he does like to remind me about things like that. And this is just the bigger picture of him going, like, seriously, Mom, you need to finish some of these books first. We also, while I was out on that thrift store shop, stopped at PetSmart where we found this sunshade dog bed, which of course you can see is, well, in my house, ideal for two cats, not one dog. Although if we still had Wolf and Storm, I have no doubt they would have loved this thing, indoor or outdoor. I still need to get pictures of the two of them, and it's been a number of years since we've had to say goodbye, but yes, they were quite the characters, just like Panther and Xena here. Of course, Panther is wanting his turn in the sunshade because, as you can see in the other picture, Xena stretches out, takes up all the room. And we're just lucky that the little Tiki hasn't decided to go hopping in there with her. Panther patiently waiting his turn, just snoozing comfy in their kitty hammock. Xena making the most of the sunshade, and Panther patiently waiting paid off, and then he got his turn in the sunshade. Of course, Xena with her poo face. But not to worry, she's comfy in the lazy girl chair. And as you can see, she uses the armrest as a headrest. And Tiki, not too worried about what's happening with anybody else or the sunshade. She's stretched out on their ortho bed. Yes, our kids are spoiled. Flashback for Xena. She used to be a tiny little girl. This, this is Xena. So you can see how much smaller she is. And you can definitely see as she's cuddled up here on this was one of the first ortho beds we had bought for the kids. Because Morgan, who, if you've seen some of my earlier episodes, she had arthritis in her back legs, so we had bought an ortho bed so she could lay comfy. Of course, Zena's taking her turn in there first. And this is Zena with her sister Ghost and their mother Cedric, who we had taken in. And sadly, in 2020, we had to say goodbye first to Ghost. She had breast cancer. And although she had the surgeries, cancer came back, so we had to say goodbye. She was losing the use of her back legs. And then in November of that year, we said goodbye to Cedric, who had, bless her little heart, multiple myeloma, and she was into month 40. But we were so blessed that she had full quality of life. As you can see, she was hanging out with her kids. She was playing. She was cuddly. She was just a little miss snuggler. But month 40, those last few days were just not good. So we knew it was time and we missed them both dearly. And we're definitely blessed to still have Zena even though she is no longer our tiny tot, she is grandma and quite the little character. Thank you so much for the gift of your time. And this week we finish 
with a song from Mr. Cardinal. And until next time, take good care.